at Johnson stood no chance. He have uh, he has two big problems, and uh, he should have gotten life in prison for that. Now, when you have domestic violence, you don't want a female police officer to arrive to investigate it, nor do you want to appear before a female judge, because that police officer will interpret any movement you make as uh, aggressive, and you're going to, you know, life is in danger, and she's going to shoot you. And just in this case, with this judge, she's empathizing with a female, and she's ready to give him life in prison. No, I don't think that qualifies him for life in prison, but living in Florida and not understanding that you have, when you're black and you're popular, rich, or successful, being black, you have to be seen and not heard. Meaning, not only speech, but any gesture that sort of uh, models your status, football star, you know, uh, this and that, you don't have problems, especially with this judge here. And, uh, I mean, everybody knows that these uh, baseball players and uh, football players, even yeah, most athletes slap each other in the arse as congratulatory. And this judge, his, his attorney was getting a deal for him, and uh, he was so excited that he just went into his um, sports career thing and slapped the guy in his butt. The guy didn't make no problem with that. The, the stupid uh, bailiff, like in them uh, TV court, how they always goggle, you know, giggling and smiling and all kind of stuff. He, he maybe is the one that was laughing and carrying on, and the judge said, uh, and, and, and decided to revoke the deal. I think that uh, this thing should be appealed, and um, <coughs> the um, people up in the court should fire her because she's just stupid. You know, um, she's going to let small things distract her, and she's going to get carried away on something that is irrelevant, something that has nothing to do with the case and that isn't necessarily showing no remorse or, or uh, glorifying uh, in that to be done to a woman or whatever, you know? So um, I, 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 I understand, you know, what he's gone through. I lived in Florida, man, and uh, anytime you're showing glimpses of brilliance, um, wealth, status, fame, whatever, even if you have a Mercedes Benz, even if you have an expensive car driving on the road, you live in a big house and cops are going to target you and you have some problems. So, I mean, he's living in the wrong state, man.